Hey guys, we are going to Peter Frampton. And I just found out that I can't take my camera in. He let us take video and photo for the first three songs. And he was talking about everybody looked like they came out of a wanted poster because he couldn't see their eyes because they were trying to get in as many pictures as possible in a short period of time. I will see you after the show. We want you. Say hi, Tommy. The way. Say hi, Tommy. Say hi. Oh, Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> I missed hey, Jane, the curb. Cool picture we got is just a cool it was amazing. It was, it was not even real. I bought a t-shirt. Don't tell my mom. But uh, I, I got a record. Don't, don't tell my don't mom. Tell my mom. <laughs> <laughs> but it was amazing like I that was not even a real show that there was like an eight minute guitar solo in every song in every song <laughs> so. it was really awesome it was really 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 awesome when you talk an eight minute guitar solo you usually think <laughs> wow that's gonna be boring it wasn't boring he's amazing very good his whole band was awesome and then they sang at the end like they all got a chance yes, to, sing. to sing that was, that was cool <laughs> <laughs> okay, I wanted to talk about though, uh, he brought out, what is the, I don't remember her name, but the the widow of Buddy Holly, oh, he brought out a guitar that she gave him that had a piece of one of Buddy Holly's guitars in it, and then he sang Peggy Sue, and he told a story about how the first song he ever sang publicly was Peggy Sue, and then he played Peggy Sue, and On you guys... On the Peggy Sue guitar. Yeah. I know you don't know how I feel about Buddy Holly, but I have feels about Buddy Holly in the heart. I love Buddy Holly. I got to go to the Buddy Holly Museum in Lubbock, Texas a few years ago, and it was incredible, and I've loved him ever since that day, because I actually ended up there on his birthday of all days, and I got him for free. And I was like, didn't even I didn't even plan on going to the Buddy Holly Museum, and then I ended up there, and I got him for free. Peter was very engaging. I mean, I, mean, I couldn't believe when he was talking about things. And then he was really funny. I thought he was so cool. Yeah, he was, I mean, he he was also doing, a call out you know, the audience do, randomly. Can, do you feel like I do? He was going, can you hear me? Okay, <laughs> or whatever. If you guys don't know, uh, Peter Frampton uses a vocorder um, yes. when he sings. A talk box. Talk box. Talk box. There's two people I know that can use that thing the best, and that's Peter Frampton and Joe Walsh. I played My Guitar Gently Weeps oh, by awesome. George Harrison or The Beatles, whatever you'd like to reference it as. Like I said before, there was like seven minute guitar solos in like every song. Every and song. And there was like oh, dueling sure. guitars. There was a pretty light show. We forget to mention that. Yeah, I mean, what was the shortest song you did probably? The first like two. <laughs> the first three. The first three songs were the shortest because he didn't, he, that's when you were supposed to be taking pictures. Like Rebel Rebel. Oh, he did a cover of David Bowie, Rebel yes, Rebel. Yes, And, and uh, He used to, he toured with David Bowie on the Glass Spiders, Glass Spiders tour, which all three of these people in this car went to. <laughs> Yes, yes, everyone in 
this car. No, nope, not you. me. Except you. I was <laughs> being born yet. I was, but you you watched it for me. Yeah. She was watching <laughs> she it was from heaven because she wasn't down there yet. She was a little angel fluttering around. Going, <laughs> I like I like David Bowie. Have, Have a great, great day, day, a great, great night, and a great, great life. life. We'll, we'll see you very, very soon. soon. Bye. bye. You guys will say bye. Cut. <laughs> <laughs>